works for them. Number 17. Out they get it back. That one a little long. Number 13. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. And the first one drops. So he gets them both. Gone three or four from downtown here in the fourth. Number seven, defended by Ramos. Gets it to go. He's got 25. That's two straight quick three-pointers they've allowed. They better not make it three straight because now all of a sudden you're looking at a hot streak. Let's catch up with Doris from the sideline. Hi, Kevin. The head coach for the visiting team had some instruction for his guys during that last break. His advice clear cut. I want to see you playing to win, not playing not to lose. I don't care what the lead is. We do not back off. passes to Green. Number 13. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. 20 points for him. How about the response? Retaliation. Impressive, huh, guys? I'll say exactly that as well. Nice job to recover those three points right away. He used that pick just right. And they're getting their points now almost exclusively from the three-point line. That's four of the last five. You've got to run those guys off the line. I agree, and the defense is practically giving them those shots, though. Passes it to Ramos. Outside, green. Shot clock at six. Number 15. Oh, good, look, good, look. good on the 13-footer. Well, since we hit half number two, he's finally come around. The first half was not his best, obviously. Number 15. Good on the 13-footer. 22 points for him. That's a clean look they gave him there, fellas, and he drains those. Outside, green. Number 15. Number 13. They get it back. Number 15. And a foul on the shot. He'll go to the strike for two. The first one falls. Oh, no, no. Off on that one, so he goes one for two at the line. He did the important part at the line there. The heavy lifting, if you will. Made this a two-possession game. Green, green, green. Number 12. A three-pointer off the mark. Boy, you wonder what the score of this game would be if they weren't pulling down all these rebounds. Love what I'm seeing from them in the paint. Kick it out, kick it out. Number 13. 
The pass to Reynolds. Got three off the mark. He continues to struggle from the field. But luckily for him and his team, his teammates have been able to pick him up and get the job done. Number 15. No good off the back of the rim. And the pedestrian 36% in the fourth quarter. The offense not doing their best work of late. The drive by Green can't connect from short range. And then the fourth has been tremendous, 59%. They set the pick. Number seven. I think 47% pretty solid. Pass to Ramos. Number 15. Gets an open look and hits. Boy, he's having a great half here. Exactly the opposite of the first. I think pretty well at 46% from the floor. You know, all coaches hate defensively when you give up easy points in the paint. That That's inexcusable. So that, that's the reason for this timeout here. I think it came down to the fact they were getting beat inside, and that's why the coach called timeout. They were not winning the battle inside. Number seven, defended by Ramos. Shoots, and the basket good, a bank shot that time. No matter what the score is, his attitude has been perfect. I love his disposition. He has stayed in attack mode. Six to shoot. Here's Clarkson. And it's off from three-point range. And as they grab one there, I was going to make the point that they just haven't done enough in terms of rebounding the ball. I agree. And the shot is good. That is some real serious dime drop in there. Exquisite assist. And back to that point you were making about rebounding Clark, it seems like they're coming up short just about every time. Well, well you're right, Kevin. You know, As we've seen here, that lack of rebounding has certainly shown up on the scoreboard. One fifty-three left to play in the final quarter. Here's the screen. Kicks it to Green. Six on the shot clock. From 17 feet out, the shot no good. Looking it brilliantly here lately. 60% from the field. Number seven, defended by Ramos. One fifteen left in the fourth quarter. To tie it up. The shot no good. Well, that's clearly a situation you want to make sure you don't give him too good of a look at it. Well, true. The defenders shouldn't relax just because he missed that one. He's capable of getting hot in a hurry. Here we go. One-on-one. -on -one. Number 15. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. And so he's picked up his final foul. And he will sit for the rest of this game.
First free throw is good, and that brings them within two here. He hits both from the strike. He's just got such a smooth stroke, and it never changes, even in this kind of high-pressure situation. Clark, they'll be trying to take as much time off the clock as they can. Exactly. Expect to see some long possessions out of them going forward. Number 15 misses the baby hook. You can see how much the defense respects him. I mean, they were all over him on that look. Number 12. Defended by Aguiar. Number 15. It's off. And so they foul intentionally. Yeah, you got to freeze the clock. I mean, that's the enemy in this situation. A few misses at the line, and they're in good shape. He drops the first one, and that will put them up by two. And so he drops them both. It's a three-point game. Man, pressure-packed free throws, but he looks cool as can be. He's so big to give them that three-point lead. What's your take, guys? Well, they've got two options here. They can go for the three and the tie, or the quick two and the foul. I like the idea of going for the quick two. Take it to the rim, and um, that wouldn't be a bad way to, to approach this situation. We've got 13 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Number eight buries the triple. And oh, that was an enormous three-pointer. And another three-pointer to their second half total. Yeah, they caught that long-range bug at halftime, and it's been bombs away ever since. Seven seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Passes it to Ramos. No, no, no. Number 15. Oh, it's off the mark. And we're going to overtime. Time expires and we're going to overtime.